Welcome back towners. Today we're making blueberry waffles. Let's get it. All right, we're making a quick video here. Uh, today we're making some birch benders blueberry waffles. Uh, now blueberries isn't a flavor of pancake mix that birch bender sells. Uh, they have a plain and a uh, chocolate chip version, but um, you can always add fruit or any other ingredients to transform plain pancakes into whatever uh, flavor you like. And in this case, we're adding blueberries to it. Uh, now the recipe calls for two thirds of a cup mix of the powder and adding half a cup of water. Just water is needed for these uh, pancakes. Um, so we basically followed those directions, mixed it up, and put it into our Dash mini waffle maker and topped it off with some blueberries before we closed it. Uh, it took about two to three minutes for this uh, waffle to um, get to the thickness that we wanted and harden up so that we can mix it. Um, if this mix did make about four pancakes, I just only did two of them with the blueberries to just mix them up of uh, the flavor. But these came out great. Uh, I like the flavor of these birch bender pancakes. Um, they don't have that much of a chalky taste to it, but it tastes pretty similar to a regular pancake or waffle that you prefer. Um, now the waffle mix for it, it says to add, um, some oil addition, uh, some additional oil to the mix. You can do that if you like, but I didn't really feel the need to do that because to me, they taste the same as when you make regular pancakes to it. But, um, if anybody's tried these birch bender pancakes or waffle mix out, let us know in the comments below or if, what other additional ingredients you may add to yours to make them taste different. Uh, but thank you guys for watching. Please enjoy. Enjoy. And please subscribe. Enjoy. Hey guys, as always, please like, share, and subscribe. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them in the comment section below. All menu items are listed in the description box and thank you guys for watching.